Hi, I'm Patty Kim from The Green Guide for Houdini.com. Making a few changes around your house? Well, why not green your renovation? A green home is a healthy home for you and the environment. But where do you start? Well, come on inside and I'll show you. Let's start with the floors. Vinyl flooring is probably what some of you have at home, especially in those high traffic areas. Now, while vinyl is easy to clean, it's made with polyvinyl chloride, which releases phthalates, those chemicals that bind with household dust and can contribute to asthma and other respiratory problems in children. Now, looking for a greener alternative? Well, how about this? Natural cork tiles made from easily replenished wood. The good thing about this is that cork trees grow in just eight or nine years, and you don't have to be a handyman to know how to work with this stuff. Cork tiles easily snap into place just like this and you don't have to use any glues to install this either. Cork is also a natural thermal insulator that helps cut back on the energy used to heat your home. Recycled flooring options include these tiles from Terra Green Classic. They're made with over 50 percent recycled glass and they're pretty too. Now this is marmoleum. Marmoleum is a linoleum made from renewable resources. And like cork tiles, marmoleum comes in tiles that actually click together and don't need glue to stay down. Marmoleum also comes in sheets, which can be installed with less toxic or low VOC glues. Volatile organic chemicals, or VOCs, have been linked to numerous health problems. So that's definitely something you want to keep your eye out for. VOCs can also be a problem in the bedroom or wherever you've got wall-to-wall -wall carpeting. The reason is most synthetic carpets are installed with glues containing VOCs. Now, if you really want carpeting, consider this floor brand tiles. They're made using recycled materials and they're held in place with stickers that look like this with low VOC glue. And you just push it up against the next piece and push down and there you go. And just like carpeting, they come in all these different colors. Now the greenest alternative, hands down, has got to be wood flooring with area rugs made from natural grasses like sisal or jute, which this happens to be. Or you can buy an area rug in natural fibers like hemp, wool, or organic cotton like this one. And they're really nice to the touch too. And if you're putting in a new wood floor, think green. Think about using fast growing bamboo. Bamboo trees grow to full size in just five years. Another option is to find reclaimed or recycled wood flooring. Now, what about those walls? We all know fresh paint smells of chemicals. Whew. But did you know those chemicals include carcinogens and neurotoxins, things like benzene, formaldehyde, kerosene, toluene, and xylene, stuff that you may have never even heard of before, but trust me, it's not good for you. Exposure to these gases can worsen asthma, cause headaches, nausea, respiratory damage, and in some cases, even nerve, liver, and kidney damage. The better way to go is to look for no VOC paints from manufacturers like AFM Safe Coat. Even Benjamin Moore and Sherwin and Williams sell low VOC paints now. Or for areas that don't see a lot of humidity, you can try this old fashioned milk paint, actually made with milk. And it kind of looks like this, all bubbly and creamy. Looks kind of yummy, doesn't it? <laughs> Good luck with your renovation. I'm Patty Kim from The Green Guide for Howdini.